Rudy's a good boy. He'd never hurt anyone. What the hell was that? Looks like we're heirs to some rich guy's fortune. His estate is worth over half a billion dollars, and I'm up for a piece of it. I may come back with a healthy inheritance. We're here! You have affected Mr. Barnett's life, and he plans to give every one of you exactly what he believes you deserve. I actually despise each and every one of you. Some just a little, some more than you can imagine. I was his wife, I should get the estate, period. Hey, I just lost the internet. I did too. You were his wife for only a month. I said period. One of you will own my entire estate, the rest of you will be dead. Your cars have all been disabled and your communication to the outside world has been cut off. He's got to be joking, right? We drove up all that way. You have to stick it out. This man is dead and he's still causing me grief. If we stay here, we're just shitting ducks. You mean sitting ducks. Check my underwear. Rudy Barnett is dead, isn't he? Someone here is carrying out Rudy's plan and making it look like he knows what's going on. And it has to be one of you. Why are you all staring at me? Ah! Back to the bedroom. He drained all of her blood. Rudy has to still be alive. The old shit could never just let anything lie. Even his corpse. <laughs> he's always known how to fuck with people's heads and he's still doing it. Anybody feel like praying? Yeah, that's productive. Are you absolutely sure your son is dead? Yes. Positively sure? My son is deceased. Bless me, Father. For I am about to sin. He always thought his next project would be explosive. And look out for each other until morning. Does anyone have to pee? I just did. You were asparagus today, didn't you?